I'm Mary from the Mama Mary Show, and along with a couple other SoCal bloggers, we're going to talk about the topic of monetizing your blog, which is what we all want to do. Um, but there's some people out there, there's a myth out there that monetizing your blog might look like selling out. It's not selling out, it's trying to bring home the bacon. But the way I've started to monetize is to find a sponsor that sponsors some of my blog posts and some of my videos, and talk about whatever I want, but then I um, write a little blurb at the bottom that says, such and such was sponsored by a certain company and maybe there's a request to like their Facebook page. Then you know what, I've got to sit through commercials on TV and I've got to sit through ads on my free Words with Friends app on my phone. Um, I can just scroll through it with my DVR just like people can use their scroll bar on my blog. That's my two cents, which is about how much I make. Hello everyone, it's Stephanie Oof, O-O-P-H dot com, and, and I am all for monetizing your blog. I'll just lay it out there. I did not get into this industry to not make money, to give it away for free, though I do think there's a certain amount of time where you probably have to do that before you can start to monetize your blog, but my intention from the beginning was to make money. I have Google ads on my homepage, and I once had someone write in and tell me that I needed to take those down because they weren't, um, they weren't good for my site. And I said, but yeah, they pay for my lattes and I'm keeping them up. The way I have found to monetize my blog successfully is in my consulting. Because I've created such a niche, because I am all boys, all teens, all the time, I have people coming to me and asking me to consult with different brands, for PR agencies that will come to me and ask me to consult with them on different brands that they are working with. Hi guys, Teresa with Rock On Mommies. Do you consider the products you receive as your monetization? Hi, I monetize my blog by feeding my family food that is sent to me free to review. Tonight we are having this lovely pasta dish made by a fictitious food company. Mom, that stuff is gross. I am not going to eat that stuff. She's kidding. It's great. Ellie! And then there's my mom jeans. Sure, they come up to right beneath my bra line. And okay, maybe they make me look a little 10 pounds heavier than I normally am. But they were free. Well, you look awful in those jeans. What? Okay, so maybe not. But we all have the same advice. No matter how you monetize your blog, be authentic. So what are your thoughts on monetizing a website? Are there certain sites that should not be monetized? certain sites that should stay true to their core and not uh, have money coming in. I don't know why you would ever not have money coming in, but what do you think? Enlighten me. Maybe I don't know something. I'd like to hear what you think.